Hi guys, Matt from Fanatics here. We have a bunch of people asking me what's going on and what's the update with our new space. We're in. We're so excited to have everybody here. We're almost ready to have everybody come check us out. Twelve at a time, that is. Uh, we're still trying to get some stuff together. We're going to give you a tour of what's going on. Hopefully by tomorrow we're just going to say, come on down. Today if you need food or an emergency, come in, we'll take care of you. But so far we got a couple things that are holding up being able to be open for general population. Come on in, see the new place. The address here is 1374 Jadwin. We're on the Jadwin side of the uptown. Uh, not quite to the end with the lazy eye and ragtime. But almost, we're on that that uh, northern sweep of the Jadwin side of the uptown. Here we are, front door. It's a push and a pull. Ooh. Wow! Come on in and see what we have here. We're setting up food right now, so at least we can find it. It's probably gonna find a new home pretty soon. We got our lights off the floor, so they're not getting kicked or ruined. See, we have products still on the floor. All our aquascaping supplies along the window. We'll actually get that in some kind of reasonable. Uh, display at some time, but even just having room to walk around it versus the old place where it was all shoved in a corner is still even better. As you can see, we've got some of our product up on the wall, a lot still in boxes. The more stuff that comes out, the easier it will be to shop. Um, we're actively working on making that easier for you. In the fish room, things are still dark. We don't have a, our lights on yet. That's part of the reason we're not ready for you. We can't find anything. We know they're there somewhere, but things got scrambled around in the move. Uh, we're still doing a lot of electrical work. But come on into the fish room, we'll see what we can see in the near darkness. You see we've got all the lights laid out here and we're trying to figure out what goes where. Give us a couple more hours. By the end of the day, we'll have a lot of this figured out. We're still even moving stuff around uh, and getting ready for a big influx of uh, livestock. We have this section here is just gonna be plants. We're gonna have like a million plants for you guys. And then we'll have each row set up with different groups of fish like we did before. Right now it's mixed bag. That's going to be a lot of work re rehoming and stuff. But as soon as we get the lights on, you guys will be able to see what we have. And we'll be able to see what we have. We'll get tags back on the tanks. Uh, we're going to be working on that all day today and uh, maybe all day tomorrow too. As soon as we get the lights and tags, we'll be ready to help you guys just catch fish. Uh, come on through. You'll see we have, this is our second row. Third row. Yeah, I'm going faster than you can keep up because we got so much to go through here. Well, fourth row. You guys still back on third row, and that's uh, the initial build. When we get uh, to the next phase of things, a few months from now, we'll actually add a couple more rows to that. And rows are going to get longer too. Also, putting together a meta center, which looks like a bit of a mess right at the moment. But Done, we'll be able to house a lot more bettas and house them well, not in cups. I, I hate bettas in cups. Uh, Stan and Martha end up living over here. We've got a redecorated tank. But Stan and Martha have their own corner. Here's our, here's our girl Martha. She's up there checking it out. She's been really excited and up and, and really interactive since we've been into the new place. And Stan's tank needs a good wipe down. You're not going to be able to see them so well, and nobody has lights. But uh, they've got their own little corner over here. We figured we can do story time. Also, not to miss, not to miss one of my favorite new things. I've got a freezer. This is a big two-door merchandise freezer for our frozen food, and I am just so tickled to have that because I'm so sick of digging in that chest and trying to show you what we got. We carry a lot of frozen food, and we'll have room for a lot more of everything, really. This place is huge and going to get bigger and fuller and weather with us the next few hours and days and we'll be up and running before you know it. Uh, tomorrow we should be able to help you easier than today and by the weekend we should be pretty close to regular business.